Hey guys, all right, let's go ahead and do a quick review today of this car windshield sunshade from Pal and Sam. Want to thank Pal and Sam for partnering with us and sending one of these to review. Guys, here is our shade. A uh, nice, heavy duty, uh, well built, well set up shade. Here's the little uh, actuators here. Um, you can see this is going to fit up inside of our Tesla Model 3. Make sure when you're ordering, you uh, measure correctly and, and select the correct vehicle uh, for your particular application. Thing I like about this, guys, it comes with a screwdriver for installation. That way you have everything you need to install. We're gonna go ahead and follow our user manual and install guide, and we will show you what the finished product is like here in just a second. Hey guys, all right, so we have our sunshade fully installed in our Tesla Model 3. Took uh, a little less than 15 minutes to put together, so really not too difficult at all. Uh, I will tell you, I started with the left side first, and that took a little bit longer. Once I had it figured out, the right side went really quickly. It attaches right here to the elbow that holds your flip down visor. Your visor can still move left and right, which is nice, so we can put it down if we need to while we're driving. I will caution you, however, you cannot swing your visor over to cover your driver's side window with this installed. This will not allow it to happen. So that's something to keep in mind. To flip the shade down, we'll simply unclip our plastic safety bracket here. And we're gonna slide it all the way down and it just kind of rests there on the dash. So as you can see, our dash is fully covered. Most importantly, our screen is covered here. This provides a ton of nice blackout shade and then to roll it up, we're simply gonna press our red button and our shade rolls all the way up. And then we're gonna clip back in. That clip holds the shade in place while we're driving so we don't have any potential issues of it coming down while driving. I will say too, on this vehicle, it kind of impedes the rear view mirror just a little bit. I have to drop my mirror down, maybe adjust how I'm sitting to uh, to get used to it. But I do think once, once we get used to this shade here, it's gonna be a really nice thing for us to have. It'll be nice not having to fool with uh, opening up one of the umbrella type shades and putting it back every time. This will be a, a real nice way for us to keep cool here in the heat of Texas and protect our vehicle. Overall guys, this shade is really great. You're gonna love it. Two thumbs up.